Kajaria Ceramics Limited is a leading tile manufacturing company promoted by Sri Asuk Kajaria ji, an engineer from UCLA, California, USA. Kajaria Ceramics Limited, that is Kassiel, set up its first tile manufacturing unit at Sikandrabad in Bulasana district for manufacturing ceramic glazed floor and wall tiles at an installed capacity of 1 million square meter per annum in technical collaboration with Messrs. Tradagres of Spain and major imported equipments and machineries from Messrs. Sekmi Mola and Amish Dew of Italy and started its commercial production in 1988. Thus, the journey of manufacturing ceramic tiles by KCL started in the year 1988 and today KCL is ranked as number one tiles manufacturing company in the country with a manufacturing capacity of 68 million square meters per annum and is ranked as number 14th largest tile manufacturing company in the world. As a testimony and a recognition of our distinct identity in providing innovative products, unmatched quality and undenting customer satisfaction, KCL is certified as the only super one tile manufacturing company for the last consecutive eight years. Be it technology, design, quality, the KCL has set its sights on all these fronts by adapting new production techniques in order to enhance the quality of its products. Strong and dedicated R&D teams of KCL has done various development activities and these are new products and process developments, improvement in the existing process, energy saving, import substitution and pollution control by recycling 100% of the process wastage generated at various manufacturing stages of production including polishing and squaring of glazed vitrified tiles produced group 5 tile in size 300 by 300 mm which was the first time in the country formulated and developed thin tiles that is tiles having 8 mm thickness in size 300 by 1200 mm this is the first time in the country we further are in the process of manufacturing biggest size glaze vitrified tiles in the size 800 by 1600 by 11 mm by installing biggest hydraulic process having capacity 7500 metric ton this will also be the first time in the country KCL is exporting in various countries like USA, UK, France, Zambia, Israel, Taiwan, Middle East, Dubai, Sri Lanka and Nepal. And the number of foreign buyers have increased many folds in the recent past. Welcome to the R&D center of Kajaria Ceramics Limited Sikandabad plant. Our R&D is equipped with various latest technologically advanced equipments installed uh, to carry out different R&D activities. And let us have a close look on these various equipments installed at our R&D center. And this is the abrasion testing machine and uh, he is Mr. Shivam and he will explain how it is operating. Uh, 
this machine is used to determine the abrasion of a gillage of a tile by the abrasive material on, on rotation. And by this, we visually compare this by non-abrasive and abrasive tiles. And if this is abrasive tile, then we classified into the four uh, classifications, second, third, fourth, and fifth group. Now, Mr. Pradeep is doing the scratch resistance on the glaze surface. Now, the scratch resistance is done by drawing minerals of defined hardness by hand over the tile surface according to the Mohs scale. My name is Upender Magazine and uh, this is the anti-skid machine. It is used for the skidness of surface of the tiles. This is diffuse reflector meter. We measure the whiteness of bright surface of the tiles. This is the digital moisture machine. We check the moisture of the materials. My name is Vikas God. I'm working on a skid resistance tester. A skid resistance scales are used to determine the degree of slippage on tile surface in both wet and dry conditions. This is a dilatometer and this machine is used to measure the thermal expansion behavior of different materials like uh, engulfs, gillages, kilage and bodies from ambient temperature to 600 degrees centigrade. Myself, Vijay Kumar Swami, I am working on the unit of measurement of plasticity index of soil. The plasticity index is the measure of plasticity of soil, where uh, plasticity index is the size of range of water contained in the soil, where soil behaves the plastic property. And the difference between liquid limit and plastic limit is known as the plastic index. He is Mr. R.K. Shubudi and he is checking the MR of these tiles. We are utilizing this machine for checking both breaking strength and this MR of the tiles by using the formula. This MR is equal to 3 WL by 2 BT square, where W is the breaking load, L is the span length, and B is the width of the tile, and T is the thickness of the tiles. Now, he is Mr. Lalit Kumar, and he is now checking this particle size distribution uh, in the collection of the grains. We normally we use this machine to check the granulometry of the powder. This is called the electric oven and we use it to bone dry our samples. He is Mr. S. K. Garg and uh, now doing this uh, printing on the tiles. Normally, we print the tiles by using this flat printing machine to check the texture of this tile surface. He is Mr. Dan Singh and he is making this uh, button for carrier the test test. Normally, we use buttons by using this hydraulic press as per our requirement of the test. I am working on frost resistance tester. This equipment is used to evaluating the frost resistance of all ceramic tiles indented to for use in condition of frost in presence of water. And the tests are carried out minus 15 to plus 15 degree temperature and Rapid mill is used for first grinding of materials. This is autoclave machine. Through this machine, the resistance to the formation of cracks, or here like crack is to be determined by subjecting a whole tile 
into the high pressure stream that is 750 plus minus 20 kilo pascal with a stream temperature of 168 plus minus 1 degree centigrade for 2 hours in this autoclave machine for 1 cycle. Then examine the crack uh, by applying the strain on the gillet surface. 5 cycles are required to complete the test. I am Ratan Singh. This is thermal shock tester machine. This machine determines the strength to thermal shock of the whole tile uh, between the temperature of cold water and the temperature just above the boiling point. This test carried out between 15 degree to 145 degrees centigrade. So this is this machine had two chambers. One is upper chamber to maintain the temperature 145 degree centigrade. And another is the lower chamber, maintain the temperature of 15 degrees. My name is Vikas God and I am working on X-ray fluorosense spectrometer, in short XRF spectrometer. A spectrometer is equipped with facility to carry out chemicals analysis of major and minor compounds like Na2O, P2O5, SO3, TiO2, CaO, MgO, MnO, including solid, pressed and loose powder. We prepare samples of pressed pellet for chemical analysis. And second machine is digital viscometer. Brookfield viscometer is used to measure the viscosity of liquid of various concentrations at uh, controlled ambient temperature. Our R&D team has developed thin tiles, that is uh, 8 mm tiles in the size 300 by 1200 and these tiles has a very high modulus of rupture strength and also flexible in nature. Our R&D team has developed the group 5 tiles, that is tiles having very high abrasion resistance surface. We are transporting all our process wastage through this pipeline for recycling purposes. We are using this material in our body for producing tiles and thus we are maintaining the ecological balances. It also helps us to reduce the cost of the body as it helps to reduce the maturing temperature of our body. That is, we are firing our tiles at slightly lower temperature and thus it helps to reduce the gas consumption. This is the R&D team of Kajaria Ceramics Limited, Sikandabad plant and this team is doing tremendous job for this various development activities related to manufacturing of our ceramic tiles. Thank you.